now. Today we're going to be testing all of these objects that are surrounding us. And here is our paper, which we are going to fit in all of these objects. So where it says material, we will have to write in the name. And then there'll be a column that says, does it bend? Does it stay bent? Does it squash? Does it stay squashed? Does it twist? Does it stay twists? Does it stretch? Does it stay stretched? So the objects we have Bumpy from a dinosaur movie and we've got some slime stuff and we've got this rainbow that we made last lockdown. And we've got this slime down here slime. And we've got this elastic band that you can snap. It's called a slap band. And it goes on your wrist for this very time. You can't choose how tight it is. It's just tight. And it just curls back up into a ball. You've got this rock all the way being peeped about it. An elastic band. Some more slime. Maybe the doll that I have. Pencil case. Uh, oops, never mind. We've got a big cushion. We've got some other say. And over here we have the Indominus Rex. Okay. Right. Okay. So the first object we're going to test is our elastic band. So I'll write in here snap band. Snap band. And then we'll see if it bends or stay bent, squash, stay squashed, twist, or stay twist, or it does it stretch or it stays stretched. So this is bent. So it only stays bent if we hold it, but when we snap it, it rolls back. So we put that in its bends. Does it do any of the other things on the list? Let's try. If I try to squash it, nothing happens. Solid. If I try to twist it, it can twist. If I try to stretch it, it would snap. So it also. Okay, so let's try this elastic one. That's the one. Let Zach help you, Tobes. That's it. And then we can twist it. That is stretchy. So it does stretch. Oh, one column. Elastic band. Elastic band. Elastic band. And this. Stretches. Let's see if it has any other things. Should we try to squash it? Do you want to try to squash it? Okay. Try to squash it. Yeah, it squashes. So put it in. It squashes. Now let's see if it bends. Does it bend? Let's try to bend it. That bends. Now I'm putting all of this in the wrong column. So squash. And it bends. And now finally let's see if it twists. It twists. It twists. So it does all of the things on our list. Does it stay bent or twisted or squashed? Let's try. Does it stay twisted? No, it doesn't. So this doesn't. This doesn't. This doesn't. This doesn't. This doesn't. This doesn't. None of this does. Okay? So, if I try to squash it, it doesn't stay squashed? No. Okay? So, if I try to bend it, does it stay bent? Mm, no. Then, if I try to stretch it, does it stay stretched? No. Okay, so the next object we are going to test is that my liquid lava putty so let's get 
It's hard to get the lid off, isn't it, on these? Um, Maybe we could ask Zach if we could use his blue slime because it's open already. Yeah. Well, I'm going to try to open mine. Can you open it? I can't do it one-handed, Tobes. Use Zach's because Zach's is already open. Let's try once more. Close all your mic, Toby. Never give up. How about with a plastic bag? Yeah, Never mind, I can use this one. Good helping, Zach. This one I'm going to put in the last get. Oh, so gooey. Here, it's squishing. As you can see, very squishy. Zach, what's your eyes with that elastic so, band? Let's see if it stays squished. Yeah, it stays squished. Does that mean it also squishes? Because it bends from an elastic out of the top. Stays twisted. Does it stretch? Oh yeah, that definitely stretches. <laughs> I'm not going to try it any longer. <laughs> In case it snaps. And it stays. And it does not stay stretched. Well, well. It does, doesn't it? It does stay stretched, I would say. Mm. But then it like gets squashed. Okay, so our next object is this. Putty. I'm going to shut your eyes because Zach says he doesn't want to see. Zach, do you want to show us this one? Well, shut your eyes, everyone. Also, you and you. And everyone which is watching us. Yes, it squishes. Oh, can you show us? Excellent. What else do we need to test? Let's take a Does it bend? Can you try it? Get it twisted. Oh my gosh, it's the same. It's smooth. And it just bends. It bends. And it twists. So, it bends, but it doesn't stay bend. Does it And squish? when it... Yes, it stays squashed. Does and it twist? It kind of twists. And it stays twist. Does it stretch? It snaps. Aww. Does it say that stretch? What happens if you hold it? Does it stretch down and fall in? No. No. So it snaps then rather than stretches. It bends. It squashes. It twists. Thank you for letting us borrow your special sand, Zach. Well, no one's allowed to see it now. <laughs> Okay, so our next material is my baby glasses. So some of these bend and some of these don't. Why do you think it's different, Toby? Why do you think some bend and some don't? Some of them are rubbery. Yeah. Some of them are maybe plastic. So which ones bend and which ones don't? I'm just going to get off two of them. One that bends and one that doesn't bend. Is that careful with that elastic band? Elastic bands are dangerous if we don't use them properly, aren't they? As you can see, very sharp. Oh, yeah. Pins. So, is this one a rubber one? Yes, it's rubbery and it bends. So, she tried, we have one to rub out something. <laughs> it might not work or it might work. And it's going to another one. Actually, there's three different types of ones here. So, why don't we choose one? Why don't we do the music badge, which is rubbery? There's still a couple more. It will be a fiddle to get them back on, but I can do that after the video. Right, that one come off. <laughs> that one just went off. So we've got this one and the last one. We've got lots of different types. These are all the different types. We've got a metal one. Does the metal one bend? The metal one won't bend. Mm, 
Will it twist? No. Stretch? No. Um, I'm squash. Squash. Will it squash? No. No. So metal won't bend, twist or squash. Do you think there's ever a situation where metal will bend, twist or squash? There could be. Can you think what that might be? It could be a metal tin or a metal drum. What happens when metal gets really hot? It burns and bends. Yeah, so if you wanted to bend metal, you'd need to get it really hot. But at room temperature, that metal doesn't, does it? But what about in an oven? Oh, we're not going to try it. But if it got hot enough, then yes, I think it would bend. So now... This is a solid one made out of rubbish. I think that's a plastic one, isn't it? And what does that do? Does that bend, twist, squash? Does kind of bend. Does it actually bend? Does it squash? Does it twist? It doesn't do anything. Right, side. With my And that's made out of rubber, is it? Yes. Right, now I'm going to just make sure that gets um, Right to Matt, can you talk to us about Bumpy, please? Well, Bumpy is a little bump than Bumpy, and its tail can swing, and its legs can move so far, but it, it can move quite fast, so it can lie down. And what sort of dinosaur is Bumpy? And Kosaur. And where is Bumpy from? Temple Chaser. And its head can spin all the way around. Brilliant. So that it's can you well, it's very hand twist like normal toys can so... you squash bumpy no can you twist bumpy well this can twist its head that's true can you stretch bumpy no otherwise bumpy will break can you bend bumpy uh, no what or do you I think can... bumpy might be made out of um Wood. Words? What do you think, Toby? I think plastic. Plastic. I think plastic's a good guess. So that would suggest that you can't bend or twist or stretch or squash solid plastic. But like a normal toy, its mouth can open. Because it's quite thick plastic, isn't it, that Bumpy's made of? Yeah, kind of. So and Bumpy has feet and Bumpy can twist stuff. Oh, so you can use Bumpy to squish that putty. Yeah. Excellent. Toby, what about your Lego rainbow? I'm just trying to skip We'll fix those badges at the end of the video, so don't worry about that. Talk to me about your and rainbow. this elastic band can go on Bumpy. I just need to write not Bumpy because there's too much going on. Too much going on. Okay, Zach, tell us some dinosaur facts whilst Toby's just writing about Bumpy. Well, I have something I really want to show you. Yeah? Well, if you say I'll be really quick. Okay, you well, say... show people at the end, Zach. Go get it, go get it. Would you say the Bumpy squashes stuff? Would you? Bumpy can squash stuff, but the question is, can you squash Bumpy? No. Basically, Bumpy cannot do anything. So what does that tell you about thick plastic, Toby? That nothing, there's nothing you can do with it except for play for it. Yeah. Or model it if it was very, very hot. So you think they got it really hot to make the toy and then yes. called it down. Excellent. Okay, so this next object is a rock. So we're going to see if it bends. It does not bend. So that means it wouldn't stay bent. This. What's this, Zach? A Prince Harry 
Let me just get a elastic band off of Bumpy. So does this rock... Don't please tell please. you what, Zach. Let Toby talk to us about the rock. And whilst Toby's writing down his answers, you can show us your police helicopter. Does this rock screw off? Let's see. No, it doesn't. Does no. it twist? No. Does it stretch? No, it does. None of them except for bend. <gasps> does it bend? No. No. Okay, whilst you're recording that, Zach, can you show us what your helicopter does, please? Well, okay. So if we put in a net, and it doesn't come out so easily, and it can't wind on stuff, well, you can't get it to wind on anything. It's funny to get, well, it just did the one bumpy, and did you see it come out? Are you trying to catch Bumpy in the net? Yeah. Oh no, poor Bumpy. Because Bumpy and Coastal, nobody can get close to Bumpy except for Ben, they are friends, real friends. Oh, good shot, Harry And I got Bumpy. Ah. Oh, Bumpy. We like Bumpy, don't we? Yeah. Bum I've got a bite to go Bumpy somewhere. You have. So, Toby, have you got anything else on your list? Yes, we've got three more objects to show. So this is my favourite, one of my favourite coloured toys that I got at Land's End after... Well, uh, I have a toy with so you got at Land's End with a world bike. Oh, yeah. And this is called Lula from a film I saw on a seat film. I'm not sure if you but you might just see my top here on my hand. Lexi's trying to join in the video. Yes, her head's in a way. Hello, Dexy. <laughs> say hello. <laughs> and let's see if she bends. So Dexy's from the film Farmageddon, I think, isn't she? Yeah. So she bends. But she does not stay bent. Does she squat? So... Should we get you down, Dexy? <laughs> so, she does squash, but she doesn't stay squash. Let's see if she twists. She does twist, but she doesn't stay twist. Stay up, Lula. Can't stop the rest of my arm. She's a nightmare sometimes. Okay, does she stretch? No, otherwise I'd pull her head off. <laughs> See if she stays stretched. No, she doesn't know that. Yeah, the head's definitely going to come off if I try that. Okay, that's that object done. Next, we have this pencil case. Okay, it's quite big. It's my mum's pencil case. That was my birthday present, wasn't it, from you guys? Okay, so this pencil case, if I open it, there's a lot and a lot of things inside of it. Here we have the okay. So inside the pencil case, we have lots of pens. We're not going to try them now because we're running out of space. And I bet you just want to relax and do your own thing now. So we're going to try the outside of it. Does it bend? It's quite hard to bend, but it doesn't bend. So that means it wouldn't stay bent. Do you have to do a cross on your tip? Oh no. Okay. Is that careful with that elastic band? It does not squash. Even if I try it with me, does it twist? No, it does not twist. What happens if it stretches? Nothing. It does not stretch. Zach, whilst Toby's recording these results, can you talk us through the Lego Rainbow, please? Now, let me talk to you through this. We've already done the slime. I'm just going to talk to you and then... This way we get... I've kind of... Do it. I've kind of... Let's be doing a little pillow because 
So Lego Rainbow is going to be our last yeah. one then. I'm going to write down Lego. And we can tell you the results. And I think there's going to be more crosses than text. Okay, so Lego Rainbow that Toby so made in the last lockdown. Bend. It kind of bends, otherwise I'll snap the board. Lego was flying, my dog would eat it. So if it's a big Lego creation on a board, then it might bend a little bit. But if it was one piece of Lego, what are we doing? One piece of Lego or a whole board? Uh, one piece of Lego. Okay, so one piece of Lego would not bend, would it? So that means it won't be stay bent. <coughs> okay, so does it squat? It's not squat. It really hurts. It squat. What are you going to... Well, would you like to tell us about an Indominus Rex, Zach, whilst well, yeah. Toby sorts out well, the results? it's a bit scary. Anyway, would you like to see how deep it can reach? Yes, please. <gasps> Don't eat Bumpy! Well, it can't eat that far, but look how far my hand goes. Oh my gosh, she looks like he's scratched you on your arm as well, Zach. Mm -hmm. Is that the Indominus Rex yeah. that did that? Yeah. Look at this magic skin of it. And it can go down low and high. See, it can go up very high. Can you tell us any facts about the Indominus Rex, huh? Well, facts about Indominus Rex that we can twist. And we can wind it up. And the other one can. And which film does he come from? Well, basically, we go Jurassic Park and Camp for Texas normally. And is yeah. he in Jurassic World as well? Nope. Can you tell us a bit about why he's such a special dinosaur? Why is so, he so hard to catch? It's so evil. Why is he so evil? What skills has he got? Yeah. Can he camouflage? No. No? Well, yeah. Yeah? No, it can change different colours. Would you like to see if you were a different than Dawn of Switches? I have. Maybe we'll save that for another video, but I would love to do another video about that, Zach. How about we do a Cheats of Facts video today? Okay. Scores up! Oh, Toby's got the scores. Let's have a look at the sheet, Toby. Are you going to show us the sheet? Okay. So there is a bit on the back. Where's your other sheet? The sheet that you filled in. Oh. Okay, let's have a look at that. Oh, wow. Okay, so let's hear the results then, Toby. Please ignore the bits on the back. Okay, so it's a So what would you say was the most bendy thing that we tested? Well, I'd say the most bendy thing that we tested would be the cuddly toy. The cuddly toy. What about the putty? And the putty, but I'm going to say it would be the putty, actually. Because the putty stays in shape, doesn't it, once you let it go? And Zach, what has been the hardest thing, the most difficult thing to twist and move? I'd say bumpy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> would you say bumpy too? <laughs> awesome. Thank you, boys. Bye -bye. Should we say goodbye? Okay. Let's go. Bye bye. Please remember the sum of how many there were 55 and 25 equals 70. Bye. Does it equal 70? No, 80. Well, bye, bye. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye, Zach. Bye, bye. bye, Zach. bye, bye. bye, Zach. bye.